like 80 mile an hour winds and you only weigh three quarters of a pound. It's got some beds made up here. If you can see the hills. You boys like in the sunshine? Huh? Found a spot to hide where it's not windy, huh? <laughs> Starting to look like a garden again. It's all right on this side of the house. Yeah. Chicken poop delivery. That's some poop. It's so cute. Buckets of chicken manure, all composted. Gonna add it to the beds. You. Come on, little yeah. digging. What are you guys finding? Finding all the cedar. Got a good snack. You guys need a brush. Let <laughs> me cover it back up. Let it warm up a little bit. Hey, girls. How's it going in there? You finding some good stuff? We have 10 beds ready, and we're just going to make a little layout of how we want to plant our seeds. Let's 
So we're mapping out here what we want to grow. We have a list of stuff that we want to do. And we're looking at the planting chart here in the West Coast Seed Catalog. So it kind of shows a chart of what we can plant. <clears throat> direct sowed into the ground or start from seed indoors. So we're in March here. So it's just going through our seed collection here. There's a few things that we're out of. We've got a lot of kale that we can start with. Some spinach here. We've got a couple different kinds. Okay, maybe we've got four different kinds. <laughs> a bunch of different lettuce. We have broccoli and cauliflower. Well, it's a little early for that stuff yet, but we could throw in some beets right now. We've got a few different kinds and some radish. We're going to try this heirloom variety of snow peas. They take a little bit longer, but they're really good. You want to plant that with the peas? Plant some carrots today, see if they come up in a few weeks. making some holes out front of the chicken coop here. We're gonna do a wall of sunflowers. So we've got peas and sunflowers that we harvested last year. And we're just gonna mix them together in the holes and see what happens. 